That's a proper nice drop, that is. All right, see what about another one? How are we doing, guys? Tonight we've got something very special, very, very special. I'm excited, actually, like a kid on Christmas. These guys are super, super local to me, right? Chainhouse Brewing Company. They are so fucking literally five minutes down the road local, right? I've been sort of looking for the beers for a while, then I was in the shop today, New Lonson Corner Shop, um, and I came across the collaboration beer they did with, <coughs> pardon me, Drop Project. This is a 6% New England IPA. Cost me about five quid, which I don't really mind. Five quid's not really much. It's sort of, you know, for craft beer, I think. And Chainhouse specialise in experimental small batch unfiltered beers. Vegan friendly, but real, real slight sort of once they're gone, they're gone small batch. Um, unfortunately, they're not allowed to sell online. I'm not sure why. Um, I'll look into that for you guys and if I can sort of maybe Chainhouse will... If I'll, I'll sort of drop a link to this and see if maybe they can sort of hook us up with somewhere to get the beers from. I'm excited. Um, drop <coughs> drop project, sorry, are based down in Mitcham, I think I believe it is, which is down south, fucking well down south, especially for us northerners, fucking hell. I think anyway, fucking down south, isn't it? Um, so I'm excited to try this. Um, yeah, I'm. I'm slightly nervous, which is a bit strange. I guess it's something so local, you don't want to fuck it up. You know, you, I want it to be really good. Um, so yeah, six percent New England IPA. There's a little QR code there for you guys. If you can give that a scan, I don't know where it'll take you. It takes drop projects apparently. What does it say? Drink fresh, enjoy socially, peace, um, vegan friendly, hops pretty fast, store below six degrees. A collaboration brew with our friends over at Chain House Brewing, chainhousebrewing.com. Check them out. Check out Drop Project at drop-project.co.uk or at Drop Project Brew on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook. Chain House, I believe, are also on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter under Chain House Brewing Co. I'm looking forward to this. It was £5, but it's a 440 mil can, right? So I don't think you can argue for 6%. New England IPA, pretty fucking good, pretty cushy, cushy little number. Oh, right, let's get it open, shall we? Little tiny bit of smoke on the opening, not much. So remember the guys, this is unfiltered, right, so there's going to be a few bits in it potentially. It's just part of the fucking thing, in it? It happens. If you don't like it, then tough it is. That is, that looks absolutely fantastic. Give it a bit of a swirl. There's sort of like a half a finger to one finger. Sort of a white cloud fluffy head. Can't see much carbonation. Let me hold it up to the light. Not really any carbonation to speak of that I can see. Super hazy, sort of super dank. Look at it. It looks fucking awesome. That looks absolutely beautiful. Let's have a sniff, shall we? It smells super juicy. Super, super juicy. Oh. Definitely orange in there. Definitely some sort of orange vibe going on for sure. Citrus, lemon. Something else that I can't quite make out. Look, I'm no fucking hop expert. Some of you guys out there, I know you. I can taste this hop and that. I, I'm just, I know I could be when I fucking try it, right? I couldn't tell you what. Half the fucking hops do, and that's not, not me, you know. I know a great beer. I'm no nonsense, no bullshit. I fucking straight up, you know. If it's great, it's great. If it's crap, then. But this, thus far, looks and smells like we could be onto a winner, ladies and gentlemen. It smells awesome. Cheers. That's really, really nice. 
really citrusy, fruity sort of um, orange marmalade, lemon, a little bit of a sort of tingle on the tongue, a bit of bitterness there as well. Give a quick swirl. Um, yeah, it's just really nice. It's like if you took marmalade on toast. So if it's got that real marmalade flavour, you see that sort of orange and sort of zingy orange, though, sort of like a stinging zingy orange, right? Was definitely something that's maybe a bit of peach. It tastes absolutely fantastic. It's super juicy. It's a proper juice bomb. Look at the colour of that. That is fantastic. I'll tell you what. That is absolutely delicious. It's not half a can. Let's have a look what it's on the can. Allergens, contains gluten, oats, barley and wheat, yep. The can out looks fucking cool as fuck, man, look at that. If you can hear a noise going on, I'm very sorry, it's my fucking washing machine, it never stops in this house, man, it's like a fucking constant train. That beer is absolutely fucking awesome. That gets a massive thumbs up from me. So smooth, so juicy, really hoppy, slight bitterness, just what the doctor ordered. That is a solid fucking thumbs up from me. Thanks for watching, guys. I highly recommend this beer. I will get in touch with them and see where else they can get it from because thus far there's another Mac on the shop. That is really, really good. <laughs> really good. I'm very impressed. I'm a happy man. Thank you for watching, guys. You've been awesome. Have a good one. Stay safe. Look after yourself. Peace.